Pronoun. Pronouns are words that take the place of nouns. We often use them to avoid repeating the nouns that they refer to. The pronouns have the same reference as the nouns which they replace. In sentence, pronoun comes on the place of subject and object and the noun that is replaced by a pronoun is called an antecedent. For example, in the sentence I love my dog because he is a good boy, the word he is a pronoun that replaces the noun dog. Types of pronouns There are many different types of pronouns that we use in writing and speech. Possessive pronouns A possessive pronoun is a pronoun that expresses possession, ownership, origin, relationship, etc. For example, that toy on the shelf is mine. In this sentence mine is possessive pronoun. Next is personal pronouns. Personal pronouns are pronouns that we use to refer to people and, sometimes, animals. The pronouns it, they, and them can also apply to objects. For example, I am afraid of mice. In this sentence I is personal pronoun. Third is relative pronouns. Relative pronouns connect dependent clauses to independent clauses. For example, I need to find a person who can read Swedish. In this sentence who is relative pronoun. Fourth is reflexive pronouns. A reflexive pronoun is a pronoun used as an object of a verb that refers to the same person or thing as the subject of the verb. For example, Ken looked at himself in the mirror. In this sentence himself is reflexive pronoun. Fifth is indefinite pronouns. An indefinite pronoun is a pronoun that doesn't specifically identify who or what it is referring to. For example, someone ate my lunch. In this sentence someone is indefinite pronoun. Sixth is demonstrative pronouns. Demonstrative pronouns are used to point to specific things. For example, this is my favorite shirt. In this sentence this is demonstrative pronoun. Seventh is reciprocal pronouns. Reciprocal pronouns express mutual relationships or actions. For example, the two fishermen love to compete with each other. In this sentence e-a-c-h-o-t-h-e-r is reciprocal pronoun. Eighth is interrogative pronouns. Interrogative pronouns are pronouns used to ask questions about unknown people or things. For example, what is an amphibian? In this sentence what is interrogative pronoun? Ninth is singular pronouns. Singular pronouns refer to a single person or thing. Like singular nouns, singular pronouns must use singular verbs. For example, she never gets a single question wrong. In this sentence she is singular pronoun. Last is plural pronouns. Plural pronouns refer to multiple people or things. Plural pronouns must use plural verbs. For example, we go to the gym every day. In this sentence we is plural pronoun. So, that was today's lecture. Thank you so much for watching. Encourage us by subscribing. Take care Allah Hafiz.